Most modern race cars, of course, are made of composite material or carbon fiber. And here at Dallara's facility in Speedway, Indiana, we're going to get an inside look at how those pieces are made. Case in point, the new beam wing flap. Of course, it comes from the design office first, and they produce this document known as a ply book, meaning that each of the plies that are laid for this carbon fiber, it shows exactly where they go onto the mold itself. Now the carbon fiber is kept in a freezer behind me for longevity and once that's thawed you lay it out onto a three axis cutting machine. This has a vacuum surface that holds it into place and cuts each of the pieces to very fine tolerances. Now once you have those pieces you assemble them onto the mold itself. Now just for this simple wing flap there's actually 42 pieces that are cut that will be applied to this mold. This is a solid piece of aluminum that has been finely machined to exactly the kind of surface that you want for the finished product. Now you start working through that ply book, meaning you take pieces of the carbon fiber, and this is known as pre-preg carbon fiber, meaning it has pre-impregnated with the resin. So there's no fumes, there's no mess. You just kind of peel off the backing and you stick it into place where it needs to go. And what's really unique about this wing flap is that it has a hinge and the hinge itself is done with a piece of rubber that is placed in between the layers of carbon fiber. This is rubber reinforced with fiber and then you actually place these little carbon dowels into place to be drilled through. Now a skilled technician is going to take for all these 42 pieces about an hour and 15 minutes to put this together and then it's time to prepare it for the curing process. The mold is first covered with this release agent and then with this breather material placed in this bag where a vacuum line is attached and watch this. It sucks all the air out and puts this under extreme pressure making it ready for the autoclave. An autoclave is essentially a giant pressure cooker. We place the mold inside, connected the vacuum line and once this is sealed up, 50 psi of pressure, 250 degrees Fahrenheit and for this piece about two hours for it to cure. Now even with this modern technology and computer design, you can see that even a simple piece like a wing flap is very labor intensive. Oh. Oh. Oh.